Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Rambit, and today I got quite a bit of a different video than uh, the normal lore stuff because um, I came across a pretty funny glitch. Um, I was trying out the rogue talent, Cloak and Dagger, which allows you to uh, appear behind your target when you use one of your uh, major moves from stealth. And uh, you might see me here in Utgard Keep, and uh, you may know that there is this dragon. Uh, just before the last boss that comes swooping in um, So he spawns outside of the invisible wall um, And I was using the glyph uh, that gives ambush increased range and With that I was able to ambush uh, the dragon before it got onto uh, before it got over the invisible wall and thus I spawned outside of the invisible wall and it allowed me to just uh, run around the uh, instance where you're not supposed to uh, supposed to be. So as you see, it uh, gave some pretty interesting footage here with the walls and whatnot. Uh, quite some things were uh, weird. Like of course there were no NPCs and everything. Uh, and of course it's possible to glitch out of dungeons in uh, several ways. Here I came across some uh, visual glitches. The map was green all the time. Oh yeah. I uh, went to try it with Shadow Step as well. Here you see the dragon in question. Um, but I think the range was not far enough because you see that it did incur its cooldown and it was just mashing the button. Um, but I did not appear outside of uh, the dungeon. Um, so that was a bit of a pity. I was thinking uh, maybe there are other dungeons where this is possible. Um, I went into uh, Shadow and Keep. Uh, which we'll see here and I uh, try to ambush the gargoyles and something pretty interesting happened or so I thought at first because um, I ambushed them here when they were faced towards me so that I would fall uh, beyond the wall um, but I just got teleported out of the instance uh, which was kind of funky so I went in and uh, tried it again on the other side where there are some more gargoyles as well. Um, but then I realized that you're actually just able to jump off of Shadow and Keep at any point and you'll get teleported out and uh, always. So uh, yeah, that wasn't very special at all. I couldn't really think of any other place where this would allow for some interesting exploring um, because Utgard Keep only allows it because you don't die if you fall. Because you fall in water. I was thinking like maybe the Nexus there are some possibilities. Um, uh, and there was this other dungeon where there would be some possibilities as well. Skyreach for instance. But if you fall down in those dungeons you just die. So um, yeah that's pretty much it. Uh, yeah thank you for watching this. Uh, on the law side of things I've got this series coming up where I will be discussing several of the uh, Arakoa. And their differences between... Uh, the Outland storyline and the Wallace and Drainer storyline. So if you're more interested in the lore stuff, then uh, you got that coming up. Alright, thanks for watching and uh, have a great day. Goodbye.